Hi, so this will be a nice quick one. I opened up my scene file here today to find that Maya had completely decimated some of my objects. Now, here's two faces it managed to save. And don't get me wrong, I am overjoyed to have these two faces back, but I'm pretty sure I modeled more than that. Now, it happens when you have history on an object generally and you save the file without clearing the history. Now, I would recommend that you clear your history, of course, but sometimes it's just not feasible. Sometimes you need to come back and work on the object and you need that history there. And let's face it, Maya shouldn't be doing this. So what can we do to solve it? Now, you'll either get a partial object left, you'll get no object at all left, or you might even end up with an object that looks completely corrupted. Well, before you throw the rattle out the pram and go screaming down the street, you can try this. Go up to Window, Node Editor, graph your object like so. You can see mine has quite a bit of history on it. And we can then start to remove some of this history. So like I said, poly mirror is often a culprit. So if I just pull these down here so we can see them, I'm going to unattach the whole node chain from the poly mirror. And then I'm going to grab the shape and I'm going to unattach it from this. So I've lost a mirror, a mirror, a tweak and a bevel. Then I'm going to come in here. I'm going to take the output and I'm going to plug it in to the in mesh of the frame shape. And my frame is back. Now, of course, I'd need to mirror this across again and do whatever I needed to do with it. But there it is. It's back. Now, before I do any of that, I'll probably delete the history of this before Maya decides to eat it again. So edit delete by type history. But in my defense, 2020 is also doing this now. So here is a, another frame that I built to a slightly different specification. And it's got two poly mirror objects on it. So I'll just remove the history. Nope, no, I won't. And that's not the hot box just playing up. I cannot get rid of it. So once again, back to the node editor, graph it. And you'll see here, they're just hanging around, flapping in the breeze. I can disconnect them. It has no effect whatsoever on my object here. And then I can just get rid of them. Okay, so definitely some bugbears in 2020. If you open it up and your file has been completely corrupted, your object's gone for a Burton, uh, try taking some of the history off it in the node editor. It might just work for you and it might save you some time. All right, that's all I've got for today. Thanks.